and here we go. So, Mitch, uh, welcome to Belarus. How do you feel? Uh, I feel great. You know, um, you know, the weather is not so so good, but um, you know, I had a good flight here. Uh, got a chance to see the city on the way to practice and seeing the facilities, and it's awesome, man. I feel great. Uh, Mitch, tell us about yourself. Who you are? Uh, well, um, if you don't know who I am, my original and first name is Demetrius Eden, but a lot of people call me Meech or and or Michi. Um, you know, I've been playing in Europe for the last 10 years, coaching, uh, helping develop football leagues. Went to college in the States. Um, got two gold medals for the national team. So I can go on and on. Um, it's too much that I've done in this past 10 years um, to name it all right now. Tell us about the teams that you played for. Which positions uh, you covered? Uh, well, in, uh, starting back in the States, I played uh, college at Northwestern University in Chicago. Uh, after that, I had a chance to play in the NFL with the Chicago Bears. Um, from there, I went on to play in the national team in 2007. Um, we was playing in Tokyo in the World, the world uh, Championships for American Football. And from there, I went on to play in France, uh, Spain, Switzerland. Um, Poland. Ah, oh, man, I've been to so, so many, so many countries. It's hard to remember all, it's, it's, all of them. It's it's really, uh, most recently, I was um, the last two years I coached in Hungary and played there. Uh, the, my first year there, we won a championship. Uh, my second year there, we made it there, but we fell short. But there's always, uh, you know, next year. So, uh, Michi, what is your natural position? Uh, my natural position is, um, I guess now you would say linebacker, but uh, in college I played fullback for, for my college team and I also played defensive end where I also um, got to start at that, that position in college as well. So, you know, I play pretty much everywhere, mm -hmm. anywhere on the defense. Uh, Mitch, if uh, you were to compare yourself with uh, one single uh, per, uh, football player, who would you compare yourself to? Oh, man, you know... Um, it's hard to say because um, if I had to say who I'm quite like, I would say my game is kind of like a, maybe like a Patrick Willis when he was playing here. You know, um, that's so very physical. Uh, I like to be physical, but at the same time, you know, you have some speed on you, just like it. You know, I have some speed on me just like Patrick does, and we don't always have to use our hand and be physical. We can use our feet to get out of situations and, and or help create situations. So um, I would say more like him. Uh, Mitch, uh, I also heard that you're not going to be only a player, but also you're going to be a defensive coordinator for the team. That's true? Um, yeah, you know, that's, the, you know that, that's what we agreed upon. Um, and even if uh, it wasn't a part of the, part of the agreement, I can never go to a team and not leave it better than it was when I came here. So um, with that being said, I'll be helping out with the defense, trying to teach the guys, uh, uh, you know, the importance of the defense. And most importantly, is just the, how to be smarter and how to play smarter, because I can teach you how to do one thing. But if you're smart and you understand everything, you have a, a basic understanding, then you can learn on your own just by uh, watching or listening. So that's that's what I want to do. I want to make these guys smarter, and that's when I make them smarter, they will ultimately become better players. Mitch, but you already had a, a short glimpse uh, at the training uh, of the guys. What do you, what can you say? Uh, I'm actually impressed. Uh, first of all, I'm impressed by the the attendance. Um, there's a lot of people here. Um, I, know, I know they said that there are more guys and more players on the team but I can tell you right now in Europe on average uh, I don't have this many people at my practices on on any of the teams that I play for this is the smallest attendance by the way this year I hear I hear there's gonna be like 70 more uh, I mean there's like 50 guys 70 plus so it's it's, it's, it's awesome I like it um, I see that there's some guys with a lot of raw talent all they need is a little bit of coaching and hopefully um you know if they accept the coaching they'll get better you know uh, do you know anything about the anything about Belarus already? Um, one thing that I've know about Be Belarus is the moment I walked into the airport is that there's some very beautiful women here. You know. <laughs> Are you looking to that part as well? Uh, I mean, you know, I'm always excited about that. You know, I like pretty faces, so uh, it'll, it'll it'll be awesome. But um, around the city, uh, I know that there's uh, there there's. There was a lot of things that happened in the city in the war that had been a lot of rebuilding. I know that. Um, I know that it's about two million people here. 
Um, so it's a it's a large city, mm -hmm. and it, it looks it looks awesome to me on you know on the ride here from the airport. It looks awesome. So um, I think I will I would like it here. <laughs> That's great. You will enjoy your time definitely. Mitch, uh, one uh, one of the last questions, but not the least, of course. The regular season NFL is coming. I look into that season. Um, you know, I don't follow the NFL as much as I used to because I can't help but to 